Right. But I'll go ahead and let y'all go. So, brother, <laughs> so, brother, so, you know, mm. Kevin, as usual, I usually disagree with damn near everything you say. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about the side. I got to cut you off. And let you get <laughs> hey, 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 get your whole shot off. So I said, let me, I'm, I'm not going to interrupt Kevin. I'm going to let him get his whole <laughs> shot off. That is not what Dr. You know, Martin Luther King understood at the end. I would lean it towards some, a lot of what William said. He realized he had made mistakes in the process of integration, not what you said, that there was an idea that they were <laughs> never going to accept us because they're still writing. Even in them five days, there's still conversations. Even in those five days, he has a book that explains some of what we're talking about, and that's not what he thought, man. So I'm going to say that to mm-hmm. you, and we're going to keep this conversation going. If you want to get back in, you want to come Let me say one second. back on the one. Let me- Go ahead. One second, a one quick thing. Quick I, didn't, I didn't go into really, why really, I think you're wrong. I'm really, just telling you, you got yeah. it backwards. Go ahead, brother. Uh, okay, all right. So I'm, uh, the reason why I say this is because I've been in this fight uh, a long, many, many years, and I've always been with the fight with them. Part of that mistake was because I've been walking the same shoes that he almost walked. I've been with those liberals, and I've listened to the things that they – remember now, King was a nice man. Just always remember that King was a nice man, and he was a pastor, and he knew he had to say certain things in a certain way. And, and in fact, that was kind of a, 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 a crutch to him. He couldn't really say what he really wanted to say. I mean, he couldn't do the things he really wanted to do. He was not. They, they'll tell you how nonviolent he was. They'll tell you about all the guns he had in the house. And them fellows convinced him to take the guns out of the house. So I'm like, how can you be part of a nonviolent movement? You got guns protecting your own family. You understand what I'm saying? Remember, there's a lot of things that are saying right, so and it not is. I'm going to jump in. We're going to continue the conversation. So <laughs> jump in because you're throwing in a bunch of information that's correct. He never took them guns out of his house, just so you know. And, and you, you started to talk about them in a way that I think this part, Bob, I mean, would agree with in this part, in this sense. Well, <laughs> rap. King stayed radicalized, and that's why he took the stance against the war. So he never bowed down to the people that he wanted to see. That's you probably like the way they they whitewashed him today. King wasn't nice at all. He didn't right. he didn't withstand forty daily death threats and be nice. That was not who that man was. I'll let